Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Ultimate Squad episode 2. Um, I have gathered all of the votes and comments um, saying which your best squad was out of the four that I linked in the previous episode and uh, I've gone with this team now and you'll be able to see it as I build it and I'll kind of talk through why I chose the players and their positives and negatives and their stats and how much they cast etc etc. Um, so there's going to be no actual um, you know, game footage in this, that will be next game and uh, hopefully you guys are going to look forward to that and that will be the start of, um, I suppose you say, the conquest of trying to uh, get into the cup final. So as you see there we have Fabianski and Koscielny at um, goalkeeper and centre back. Now both players are very good and uh, no, um, Chesney uh, he's 40k, now that is a lot of money for an 83 rated goalkeeper so um, if you're looking for a goalkeeper in your Barclays Premier League team or a uh, hybrid team I wouldn't recommend getting him, he is a good keeper but not 40k good there are other goalkeepers that you can get that are going to be even better for a cheaper price like I think of Czech, Reina, um, Inform Friedel and all that stuff so yeah, um, good goalkeeper but I wouldn't recommend him for the money now as you can see there I've got that Premier League kind of linkage going up down the left and then at the top I have Pato and Robinho now the reason that I chose these two is obviously because they have their great Brazil Serie A AC Milan link and uh, they're both 5 star skillers with quite a bit of pace as well so I thought that would be nice for you guys to see some sexual skilling gameplay hopefully um, and uh, the CDM and the centre attacker mid are um, Inform Cruz and Inform Muller now these two um, are both kind of they both have three star skills so I'm not going to be trying to do advanced rainbows and all that with these guys um, they're just two really strong players that are going to get the job done and uh, then as you see that the centre back and the right back both are uh, Brazil, Brazil um however you say it and both have quite a bit of pace for defenders as well so um, now I'm just going to be going through the stats of each player showing you there looks a senior 90 pace and very attacking stats very good all round consistent stats there um, Tiago Heleno, 74 pace, 86 or 80 head in, I think it was, I didn't really get to see it that well. And uh, then Clichy as well, the 89 pace. Um, Torre, one of my best players on FIFA, such a strong player both physically and, uh, you know, he's got uh, all round good stats, in, he's good at heading, dribbling, so three star skills, great shot, powerful shot indeed. And uh, he's uh, very tall as well. So he's going to be winning those headers from corners. Um, and uh, then as you see, Alexandre Pato with 87 and Rubinho with 88 pace. So as I said, very pacey players up front indeed. Now um, I was going to go through the costumes of each player. Now I actually got donated this Chesney because I was streaming while building this. And uh, I was complaining about how uh, how much Chesney was. And then some guy said that he would give me him for free. So very thank you um, to you, Toon Army 141 I think your name was. Um, Koscielny there, 27k, not bad buy actually, is pretty good. Um, Clichy, bog standard, just over 1k. And Yaya Torre, his price has dropped quite a lot. I can remember a month or two ago his price was around 30k. Just shows how much the uh, the FIFA Ultimate Team market is deteriorating at the moment. And uh, David Silva, the 88 version goes for 40k. And I think the 87 version goes for about uh, 30 20k actually so guys thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it please leave a like comment rate and subscribe i'm out bye bye